We review children's books so you don't have to. Kid Lit Crit! Today we're going to be reading Good Night Moon by Margaret Weiss Brown with pictures by Clement Hurd, published way back in 1947. I really enjoyed this book, and that's why we chose to talk about it today. Dan, what do you think of the book? Dan! What do you think of the book? I swear to God, Dan, if you don't wake up this minute. Wake up, for God's sake. Wake up. Oh, wake up. Sorry. Can't do these if you're going to sleep through them. Sorry, I, I was up all last night. I had bad insomnia. You should have read today's book. It probably would have helped. That book is a menace. Teaches kids to say goodnight to inanimate objects like clocks and socks and bears and chairs and who knows what else. Kids need to know that those things don't have feelings and don't care. I think it sets a peaceful and lovely bedtime mood for kids. Nobody says goodnight to mush, not normal behavior. I think it's great to say goodnight to everybody and everything. Goodnight kittens. Kittens! Goodnight mittens. Goodnight mush. Good night, comb. Good night, grandma. Good night, teddy bear. Good night, applesauce. Good night, that piece of dog. Kittens! Dog hair mold that's under my bed. Good night, pillow. Good night, kittens. Kittens! I think you're insane. You sure are grumpy when you haven't slept. The book really got to me. It got inside my head. It, it got inside your head. I started to wonder if the things in my room are alive. Like my clock with its red LED eyes ready to strike any minute. And the moon. The moon. Just out there. Watching. And waiting. It's just a moon. Just the moon. So I guess it's a big thumbs down from you. I can't recommend this book. Uh, tell your kids just to say goodnight to members of their family. Just the picture of those three bears sitting in chairs will forever haunt my dreams. Terrifying! Terrifying! I personally really enjoyed the three bears in chairs. And I intend on reading this to my children. Maybe getting some three bears in chairs of my own getting a bowl of mush or a cute little bunny to put in bed, you might remember your parents reading it to you when you were little. That's it for us this week. Right, Dan? I'm going to kill you in your sleep. See you next time. Good night. I was even ready for that. But... Sorry about that one. <laughs> no, <sorry>. Don't know. <laughs> Where on the doll did I touch you? <laughs> Wake up! Kittens! Just went crazy. <laughs> Good night, dresser. Good night, that t shirt that I wore that one time. Good night, Grandpa. Even though Grandpa's dead, we can. That's family. That's family. Kittens!